Hey, it's Walt, K4OGO. Well, it's absolutely a beautiful mid-November day here on the Mid-Atlantic coast. It's like 75 degrees Fahrenheit, so I uh, figured I'd come down here to my local beach, Virginia Beach, Virginia, and uh, play a little radio. Let's do a little 5 watt QRP here at SSB. So uh, here I am, that's the Atlantic Ocean behind me. The Chesapeake Bay is right over here, and uh, I thought I'd break out a little kid's toy, a slinky. Build an antenna and see what we can do. Let's have some fun. Stick around. Okay, so here's today's setup. I've got a giant slinky, the original giant slinky, and what I've done is I've, uh, I've soldered a little bit of a lead wire for it to hook it up to the QRP guy's uh, un antenna, uh, 9 to 1 un un, and I've got my coax, my Zygu X5105, and I've got four counterpoise wires with uh, four ounce uh, fishing sinkers on them to uh, hold them out in the water. And I have my surf rod holder, and this is a 16-foot uh, telescopic uh, rod pole that I have that I'm going to build the antenna on. So this is what I've got. We're going to put it all together, and uh, let's have some fun. Well, I took a little bit, a little effort there. It was about 15 minutes, but I got it all together. The worst part was getting these uh, counterpoise wires untangled. As you can see, I've got them pretty much about 180 degrees total here. But I got them out. Got everything wired up here. I've got the uh, the un un in, and there's the antenna. So uh, let's go play some ham radio. See if we can make any contacts. Hi. Right. Are you the guys looking for the baby? What's that? Are you the guy looking for the baby? No. Oh, I thought you might be like. I'm a ham radio operator. I just started playing with my radio. That's an antenna. I made an antenna. Oh, I thought you were kind of. Oh no, no. I'm just out here. I'm just. It looks like almost like this equipment. I'm just a nerd with the radio playing ham radio. That's all I am. <laughs> so here's the SWR. I ran it at about the midpoint of each band, and then uh, the only thing really happening was on 20. And in about an hour's time, I made five contacts. Uh, QSL and thanks for the coming back there. I am running five watts. I'm holding a Zygu X5105 in my hand, using it as a handheld. I've got a, a vertical uh, slinky. I actually have a kid's toy slinky. I'm sitting on the beach, a slinky up a telescopic pole with four uh, counterpoises uh, cut to a quarter wavelength for 20 meters and they're touching the uh, edge of the Atlantic Ocean. I'm right on the Atlantic. Kilo four, Oscar, golf, Oscar. Kilo four, Oscar, golf, Oscar, and portable QRP. Uh, QSL, QSL, can you come back with your call? I didn't quite catch it. Uh, roger, Roger, you're a 5-3 into Virginia Beach, Virginia. I'm five watts on the beach with a slinky up a pole, sitting on the beach doing some QRP. And I think I got KE0BIM, is that correct? Yes, it's Kilo 4, Oscar, Golf Oscar. I'm portable QRP on the beach in Virginia Beach, Virginia.
wasn't happy with those signal reports, so I moved the antenna closer to the water and got the wires directly into the waters, and it really picked up. Uh, Kilo 4, Oscar, Golf Oscar. Kilo 4, Oscar, Golf Oscar. You're 5'9 on the beach of Virginia Beach, Virginia. I'm 5 watts QRP. You're sounding great. I have a slinky, a child's slinky on a telescopic fiberglass pole. Well, I think it's the uh, four counterpoises I have directly into the Atlantic Ocean using that what we call the saltwater amplifier that's doing the trick. Seventy-three. Okay, I figured I'd fire up the ATU and give it a shot on forty meters. Kilo four, Oscar, Golf, Oscar. Kilo four, Oscar, Golf, Oscar. K four, O G O. Kilo 4, Oscar, Golf, Oscar. Well, I'm not doing so good on 40. Well, that was fun. I had a good time. Um, made some contacts. I'm pretty uh, happy with that. Would, uh, would I use this antenna again? No. no. It was, this was just having a good time. It was... It was, it was uh, Go to the beach and goof around and have a good time. You know what? It, it was uh, the salt water ice, like I said, you heard in some of the cues. That, that really does a trick. You can put a coat hanger up and an antenna tuner and throw a counterpoise into the salt water and you'd probably make contact. So uh, it was fun. I enjoyed playing around with it. I don't think I'll do it again. Maybe. Who knows? Uh, I got a lot of other antennas I want to play with in QRP world. So anyway, thanks for watching. Uh, please subscribe, ring the bell, and you'll be up to date with uh, other stuff that I'm doing. And um, if you watch this all the way up to now, hey, thank you. I really appreciate it. 73.